Thanks for tuning in. This is Growing in Purpose. I am your host, Angela. Join me on this journey as we grow in the things of God and see what God's word has to say in regards to the things that's concerning us because he is concerned. Let's grow together. Bad habits. You know, I have a, our youngest child has this habit of sucking her thumb and she's done this ever since she was born. And, you know, at first you're like, oh, it's so cute. But as you're getting older, you know, as you know, that habit is going to eventually cause damage within the mouth, right? It's going to either push your teeth out or mess up the frame and structure of your jaw. So what you thought was cute as a habit ultimately is going to be detrimental to the appearance of your face, the structure of your mouth, and how other things need to grow with inside of you. And that's what we need to focus on right now as believers. What habit, or should I say, what bad habit have we indulged in thinking that it was okay, but at the end of the day, if we keep on dealing with that, if we keep on functioning in that way, it's going to ultimately dump damage a functionality within us that God has for us. It's going to damage the structure that God has already ordained for us to be. It's going to prevent other things from growing inside of us, uh, our spiritual gifts from developing, our spiritual mandate from developing. What bad habits do we have? And we have to really focus and and take notice when the Holy Spirit illuminates that in us and shows us, hey, look, this is off. And one of the ways that we can really hone in on what is detrimental to us is by fasting, right? The Bible says some things don't come out until you fast and pray. Some things don't come to the surface or not revealed to you until you fast and pray. You know, power comes within you to, yeah, yeah, it's all good to have the power to cast out devils and lay hands on the sick, but we need to deal with self. Like what is in us? Some things in us is not going to be revealed until we fast and pray. And that thing can come to the surface. So I really encourage you to seek the Lord, seek him in all of his great wisdom and knowledge as to what bad habit you need to break. What bad habit have you taken hold in? And it, it, it becomes like an afterthought to you, right? Like my daughter sucks her thumb and it's just, it's just natural to her. It, it's, it's something that she does. And I have to be cautious. And my husband, we have to be like, uh-uh, take that out. Take that out. We're going through the breaking phase of breaking her out of that. And God wants to break that those bad habits out of you. So the thing that he needs to grow in you can grow properly. So seek the Lord in all of his wisdom and see what bad habits you need to break and fast and pray. And I, I got another story to tell how fasting saved my life, but I'll save that for another episode. Until then, let's continue to grow.